Hi, I'm Chris, and I'm a sales engineer here at Trey.io. And welcome to the first of many Connector Spotlight videos we're going to be publishing. Um, in this series, we'll quickly cover some customer use cases with our most popular connectors. Um, this first video will be focused on our JIRA connector. Uh, the JIRA connector is a popular issue in project management integration used by our customers, including Intercom and InVision. Um, it's also an approved third-party integration listed on the Atlassian marketplace. Um, so without further ado, let's jump right into it. In this first workflow, you'll see an automation with JIRA and Salesforce. Um, one common problem is that the sales team often lives in Salesforce, and uh, when issues come up uh, with the customer and the product, uh, they need to get those issues into the development team's workflow in JIRA. And um, one way to do that is with Trey, you can build a workflow that will trigger any time uh, an issue, an issue being a custom object in Salesforce is created. Um, so we'll read that issue, get the issue details from it, see what kind of issue it is. Is it a bug fix or a docs fix? And then we'll pass that data directly into JIRA and create, create a ticket for the dev team to uh, follow up on. Additionally, going the other way, it's really important that um, once an issue has been updated or completed, um, that we get that information back to the sales team as quickly as possible so that they can get with the customer and hopefully move that deal along. Um, so one way we can do that is to build a workflow in Tray that looks at JIRA tickets and says, anytime an issue is updated, I want to look at the sales opportunity associated with it, update that, so maybe put the new status in uh, Salesforce so the sales team can see it directly in their tool, and then we want to look up the salesperson who's working on that opportunity and then look them up in Slack and send them a message directly and say, hey, this issue has been updated. Uh, might be a good time to follow up with your customer now. Another common problem many companies face is that um, people will submit issues with the code in, in GitHub, um, but the development team might be working out of an agile software project management tool like Jira. So one way of handling this with Trey is to say, okay, we, we want to trigger a workflow to run anytime a new issue is submitted in GitHub. And when that issue is submitted, we want to look at the label that's on it and see if it's a bug, documentation error, a question, or if it hasn't been labeled at all. Based on those criteria, we can create a bug ticket in Jira, create a documentation ticket for a different team, or we can even send that into Zendesk and create a ticket there, but also message our Slack channel and say, hey, something going on here. Let's try and get back to this person as quick as possible and really give them a better support experience. And if there's no label at all, uh, we can just put that into a triage bucket and get it triaged later on. 